I went to the master's program and just started writing essays and was just sort of learning what a personal essay actually meant after I got over my anxiety about the idea of writing a book or calling myself an author as opposed to a writer. Um, I was able to sort of move on and write a proposal and acknowledge that, okay, even I can write a book. <laughs> I think uh, there are a lot of wonderful exercises that you can do to use your, to kind of trick your memory and your brain into remembering what you think you don't remember. There is a sense of when you're writing about something private and personal, you're, it's no longer private and personal and you're really, especially when you're writing about other people, there, there's a question of, um, you know, whose toes are you, are you stepping on and what what part of your friendship is no longer private? And are you strengthening bonds or are you weakening bonds? I definitely spend more time editing than writing. Uh, it's sort of the, the dirty secret of writing. I think a lot of, of my friends who aren't writers um, think that I spend all day, you know, sitting with a cup of coffee or a glass of wine and just, you know, writing my journal and, <laughs> and you know, staring out the window. Well, that's not. And if you're a writer, that's not how you spend most of your time, and probably all of you know. Um, a lot of it is staring at a blank page and biting your fingernails. Um, a lot of it is staring at a page full of stuff that you wrote and looked really good yesterday, but today you want to erase everything on there and you think, who wrote that? Where did the stuff I wrote yesterday go? 